everyone, it's John Costa. I hope you are all doing well during these difficult times. And today I'll be recording my penultimate Rotman Commerce mini series video where I'll be talking about RSM 250, which is Introduction to Marketing. So RSM 250 is a recommended course by Rotman Commerce and I took it in my first semester of my first year with the professor Ryan Webb. In terms of the class size, we were around 60 to 70 students in each class section for RSM 250. And for my class, we had it in the Faculty of Social Work at the University of Toronto, which is right next to the Varsity Blue Stadium. And because we were on the fifth floor, we had a beautiful view to the Toronto skyline. Regarding the class material that's taught in RSM 250, it covers a lot of different marketing principles. When looking at the weekly schedule under the syllabus for RSM 250, we can see that the first few topics are about market research, segmentation, targeting and positioning, the STP, and then we talk about products and brands and the different types of principles that are used in marketing to help promote them. Furthermore, we go into a few case discussions, I believe three, uh, which change every year and we look at a specific company and how their marketing practices differ with one another and what they can do to you know, increase their brand awareness. And finally, there's going to be a guest speaker as well as a presentation that will be delivered by a group about a marketing case. So this class does not have a textbook per se, however there is a package that the professor asks you to get which goes over the different marketing cases that are necessary when doing the case analysis and later on your final presentation. So that is necessary and details as to how to purchase them are covered in the first class and also on the course syllabus, so it's very easy to find it. When looking at the grading scheme for RSM 250, you will see that the class participation mark is very big, it's worth 15% of your final mark. On top of that, you have the 3% research requirement that is done through the platform Sona, which is affiliated to the MBA lab. I talk about this in one of my other videos where I explain the different research studies that I did throughout my first year and I briefly show the Sona platform that I used. Furthermore, there is the midterm exam, which is a quarter of your final mark, and then group casework, which is 17%, so it's also quite significant. And I do recommend working on that as soon as possible, similarly to the RSM 100 course, the sooner the better. And finally, the final exam is worth 40% of your final mark. So there's a lot of emphasis both on the midterms and the finals. RSM 250 is one of the three recommended courses by Rotman. So it's RSM 250, RSM 219, and RSM 230. So once again, it means that as long as you get above a 50%, you make it second year of Rotman. So it's, it counts as a credit. So you don't have to worry about a minimum guaranteed admission mark. My biggest recommendation for this class is to go over the different concepts and principles that are covered throughout the course and make sure that you have a solid understanding of the different vocabulary and keywords that are used throughout the lectures because if you include them in your midterms and different assignments they're really going to be valued and it's something that the professor is really looking for so it shows that you know you have a good understanding of what is covered in the class and you're able to use the the words effectively in the right context so depending on the questions given. I believe the best way to do this is through a mind map. So having a visual diagram where you have the different big topics for the class as well as the keywords in each one, you'll be able to study a lot more effectively because you'll be able to look at it and immediately those words will come naturally to you and because you're so familiar with them, once you're in a midterm or an exam, they will be at the back of your mind so you will just apply them normally and that is the best feeling ever when you're writing a marketing exam and you know exactly what to say and what to apply. That pretty much sums up all I have to say for RSM 250 which is Introduction to Marketing. I hope you found this video helpful and that it gave you some insight as to what you can expect going into the class next year. Obviously if you have any questions feel free to reach out to me and I'll see you guys in my very last mini-series. Bye!